The suspect in a triple stabbing that left two men dead in downtown Nashville claims he acted in self-defense. Michael Mosley is charged with homicide but says he's not a violent person. Tonight, News Channel 5's Nick Barris obtained exclusive video that seems to tell a very different story. Video that will be key evidence in the criminal case. Before Mosley was arrested for that triple stabbing, he was already charged in a pending aggravated assault case. And evidence in that attack is sure to raise question about Mosley's demeanor and conduct. It's all right there on the security video from this Nashville Walmart on Charlotte Pike. Metro police say Mosley walks in with a gray hoodie talking on his cell phone. He's looking for someone, and when he finds her, he attacks. You see Mosley catches the woman completely by surprise, knocking her to the floor. He proceeds to kick and punch her repeatedly. Police say at one point he stabs her in the eye with a key. Then, as other customers approach, Mosley runs from the scene, out the front door, and into the parking lot. He's later arrested. Somebody just hit me in the eye. So, you know, I lost my sight and I was covering in it. You know, he started throwing me and kicking me. That was two years ago. This is Molly Baker today. Why did Mosley attack Baker? Well, she and her husband Daniel are awaiting trial charged in the shooting death of Mosley's stepbrother back in 2016. But Mosley was arrested for taking matters into his own hands by going after Baker. And video of that attack now raises questions about his conduct in the triple stabbing case. A person has a right to defend themselves if they think that they are in danger of serious bodily injury or death. Mosley is charged with stabbing Clay Bethard and Paul Trapini III to death and injuring A.J. Bethram outside the Dogwood Bar on December 21st of last year. In a letter to News Channel 5, Mosley wrote, I feel as though I've already been convicted by the way I was portrayed. His lawyer, Justin Johnson, says it's unfair to judge Mosley on his criminal past, which includes assaults and burglaries. He says his client acted in self-defense. Prosecutors say the attack outside the bar was not justified. There is absolutely nothing that Clayton Bethard and Paul Trapini and AJ did to bring this on themselves. This video, which police say shows Mosley attacking a helpless woman by surprise in a very public place, is sure to raise questions at trial. We know there is video not yet made public of the stabbings outside the bar, which will be used at trial. I've also learned prosecutors have now met with Baker and may also try showing video of that Walmart attack to the jurors. Nick Barris, News Channel 5.